the builder of the nation. So let's invest in building on women's strength for the change we need to see. Right now, if you look at everyone here, you see that people are healthy. Why? Because there is a woman. There is a woman at home. There is a woman at school. There is a woman in church. There is a woman in leadership. Digital literacy. To ensure that at least young people get to, to, to be creative. Yeah? How can they tell this, their stories? Not by standing here and talking because they, they may read very few. But how can they use the phones that they have? How can they use the media, the social media platforms to communicate, you know? In line with that, I am proud to tell you that all that you're seeing, all these drawings, all these write-ups, all these paintings on the global platform uh, walls were not paid for. All these were designed by young people. In, in, in the struggle, like as we go to fight against the gender-based violence, early pregnancies, we ought to all come together and stand out together and bring our minds together, bring our ideas together. Then here we have written enough is enough. I feel as a girl child, as a woman, as um, who is out there and those who are here, I believe there are so many struggles that we have gone through and we feel, yes, we can communicate this photo and say enough is enough, communicate and and speak in the pictures that this we can fight together, this we can run together, this we can advocate for. So we are grateful and we thank God for Global Platform for giving us to, to discover the potential that lies within each of us. And as young women, we must be strong to uplift each other. Thank you for allowing us to come here and create Network, share, learn, unlearn, and relearn all the aspects in life, in leadership, but also in as the young feminist movement. There is a lot that is always talked about when it comes to feminism, but we are here to tell you that is not true. We don't talk feminism, but we live it. Me, and my parents bought us and we were five girls and in our community wherever we whenever we got out of home whenever we go for water they would say hmm now these girls what are they they are not children they could abuse us they could look at us as those people that will not make it in life strong i am strong i am strong i am beautiful Regina is beautiful, eh? Yeah, I can see. Yeah. So, my humble request to you girls, go and study hard, please. We do a lot to get this money. And you are our children. We want a bright future for you. Go and study hard, okay? Okay. Which is, uh, we, are, we were looking at the roles of women in families. And we wanted to see how a woman in a family can influence everything that happens, or how women can influence actually the world. Uh, the few highlights of our drama was about uh, girl-child education, uh, united family, inclusive education, support to our girls, especially those who got pregnant, or those who get pregnant actually, before finishing their education. So we have so many things to celebrate as women. We celebrate our womanhood. We celebrate our sisterhoods to building towards the economic development of this nation. I can't say I need you because I know you are always there for me. All I can say is thank you, Mom. I say this for God and my country as I look forward to building on women's strength in COVID-19 world. Thanks.